What's up everyone, Coach KG here and I'm gonna show you how to do a seated calf raise. Phenomenal exercise for your calves but often done improperly. So just A to Z, we're gonna jump into it. I've got some weight here. The biggest thing is setup, right? So there's different adjustments. Oftentimes you can adjust the seat. So you wanna make sure that when you get into the position that this pad is nice and tight here, okay? A common mistake I see is just a lot of times people just don't actually think about something like this. They have it too tight or they have it way too high. So we wanna make sure it locks you in here to the point where you're nice and stable, you're nice and sturdy, okay? You're locked in and you're good to go. Next up, often there's a nice little handle here. So you just wanna lift up, okay? Let that handle go to the side. Every machine's gonna be different, but that's usually how it works. You're gonna go like this. I personally like to hold on to here just to get some nice tension and just kind of lock myself in here. And you're gonna control on the way down and then just go to the full top, right where you get a nice squeeze, a nice contraction in the calves and just continue to rep it out, okay? Once again, holding on to this, nice and controlled. Boom, control all the way down. You wanna get to the point where your, your heel is actually a lot lower than your toes. That way you get a full rep and then just go all the way up, okay? and rinse and repeat, and you're good to go. So now we're gonna jump into three common mistakes that I see very often. And number one common mistake is just not utilizing the negative. So very often I see people just get on this machine and just wrap it out, just like this, right? You wanna make sure that you control it. Three, two, one, boom. That's where you're gonna get the most out of this exercise, the most time under tension, and the most growth overall. And number two, I've slightly touched on this, for every single exercise, just range of motion. I see too many people loading up weights that they can't actually control. So once again, when you do this, you wanna make sure that you go nice and low. You get a lot when you go down here, right? But a lot of times people just stop right here where their feet are fully in line, but that extra little bit, that's a good full range of motion, right? So avoid just doing this, okay? This isn't an actual calf raise, right? Like you are raising your calves, but it's not a full, you know, range of motion uh, calf raise. And that's it, it's a very simple exercise, but also very effective. Uh, make sure to click the first link in the description to check out what we do. We obviously do online coaching just to help everyone optimize their form, but above all, get results through nutrition, lifestyle, as well as accountability and training. So make sure to check that out, apply. If you are looking to get some killer results, smash that like button and we'll see you in the next video. Peace out.